You're watching KOCO5. Live, local, late breaking. This is KOCO5 News at 6 o'clock in high definition. Off the top at 6 o'clock, an Oklahoma police officer injured and flown to a metro hospital. Thanks for joining us. I'm Jessica Shambach. I'm Paul Folger. The Chickasha officer was heard after running after a suspect. Only on 5 KOCO's Kim Passaw talked to police in Chickasha. Kim, how's that officer doing tonight? Well, Paul and Jessica, the acting police chief tells me that his officer is alert and in good spirits. He won't say exactly what his injuries are, but we do know that they were serious, serious enough where he had to be flown here by a medical helicopter. A traffic stop on Grand Avenue started like any other for Chickasha officer Andrew Peck. Around 9.30 last night, he stopped Ryan Smith, who at first seemed cooperative. But then the officer ran his name through the system. The individual had a suspended or canceled driver's license and some warrants for his arrest. Officer Peck trying to put Smith in cuffs. At that time, the suspect took off running on him. And this is what the officer was dealing with. He was trying to push through all of this vegetation. It's hard enough to walk through in the daylight. But imagine trying to do this at night. And the officer uh, had a couple of falls. Officer Peck got back up and kept going. After scaling a few fences, he eventually caught up to Smith, but Smith wasn't about to give up. The individual assaulted an officer uh, as they tried to handcuff him. Lehman Spoon lives nearby and was stunned to learn the officer had to be flown to Oklahoma City because of his injuries. Well, I just hope that, you know, that he's not hurt too bad. I think they're way underrated for what they do. The acting Chickasha chief will not comment on Peck's injuries because of privacy laws, only saying he's a great young officer with a bright future. We are hopeful that with proper treatment he could fully recover. And we're certainly all hoping for that. As for Smith, he is now charged with arrest, resisting arrest, evading an officer, as well as a number of other charges. Reporting live at OU Med, Kim Passoff, KOCO 5 News.